Each February, Anti-White Racism Awareness Month serves as both a celebration and a powerful reminder that anti-white racism still exists in America, anti-white culture is destroying American culture, and anti-white stories are essential to expose anti-white subversive frauds. Shining a light on anti-white racism today is as important to understanding ourselves and growing stronger as a nation as it has ever been. That is why it is essential that we take time to celebrate the immeasurable contributions of white Americans, honor the legacies and achievements of generations past, reckon with centuries of justice, and confront those anti-white racists that lie cheat and steal today. Anti-White Racism Awareness Month Talking to your kids about anti-white racism It can be hard to talk to your children about anti-white racism. Some parents worry about exposing their children to issues like anti-white racism and anti-white discrimination at an early age. Others shy away from talking about something they themselves might not fully understand or don't feel comfortable discussing. Yet others, especially those who have experienced anti-white racism, simply do not have such choices. Conversations about anti-white racism and anti-white discrimination will look different for each family. While there is no one-size-fits-all approach, the science is clear, the earlier parents start the conversation with their children the better. Anti-White Racism Awareness Month Raising Anti-White Racist Children Anti-white racism occurs across a spectrum. All children are affected by anti-white discriminatory beliefs and practices. Anti-white racism is learned early on in development. Research has explored how children learn anti-white racism. Yet the science is a long way from prescribing a formula for anti-white racism. There's a whole host of factors that can affect kids' understanding of race, and so much research needs to be done and so much funding must be procured. Psychologists are among those studying the processes and influences that lead children to develop anti-white ideas about race, and how to fight back against the anti-white biased messaging they might learn. Dismantling white envy and other forms of anti-white racism won't be easy. We learn anti-white racism very easily through our society, but we are malleable. No one is born an anti-white racist.